Hey YouTube, what's going on? It's your boy MCore30 coming in. Fan Pack Project 2015 episode 21. 21. 20. 21. We're legal. We're legal. What's up? It's been a couple weeks. Um, I was sick. Um, really wasn't in the mood to uh, to fan pack it up. Episode. This cam is horrible. Uh, episode wise, really wasn't in the mood to do anything. Let alone get out of bed. Um, that hasn't stopped the fan packs from rolling in though. They're still coming in, you know, one, two a day. Um, so I gotta get caught up here. Um, update: We are gonna be doing fan pack two, fan pack challenge 2016. Mcore 30 and slash D Nuggets triple double three. D Nuggets 33. Um, we're gonna be doing fan pack challenge 2016. A year-long competition slash challenge. See so who gets the most fan packs uh, throughout the calendar year. We'll be starting that January 1st. So I had to get caught up on all my fan pack videos for 2015. Uh, prior to that, he said. So I get these done. Um, so we had a couple episodes. And then by the end of the year... Whatever fan packs have come in in this in this next week um, will be the final episode. No matter how many uh, videos or how many fan packs there are, usually it's ten per episode. But it's the last one for the for the fan pack project 2015, and then we will kick off our challenge 2016 challenge. Uh, we will be doing. It's going to be. Um, Videos are going to be posted every Sunday, I'm hoping, God willing, uh, it's going to be, you know, the Monday through Saturday, uh, and then it'll be Sunday fan pack video reveal day of what we got for the whole week, so it'll be a little different than what you guys are used to with 10 fan packs, it could be 2 fan packs for the whole week, um, or it could be 20, so, um, I think what I'm going to do is... Just so there's no confusion, uh, and this is just a little friendly thing anyway, so it's not like, you know, but it is still a competition. Um, we might put a little prize on the end for whoever gets the most. Um, what I will be doing is I think I may post my packages on Instagram or Twitter or Facebook. Um... But I'm not going to open them. I'm going to do all live openings just so i um, not really getting, you know, just so you guys know it's legit and then those are actually what I got for that fan pack week instead of maybe reusing, you know, a couple of the 200 and some other ones I got just because I want to win our, our challenge. Uh, so I will be doing live, there will be live openings um, on Sundays of my fan packs. Uh, week one, we'll kick it off. Um, I'm actually gonna start sending out some more emails. I have sent out some emails, so we'll see what happens and what comes in. Um, also, working on TCM project, UFC TCM project. Excuse me. Um, got a huge, huge stack. Of envelopes going out. Also, a little pack, a little holiday package for uh, for somebody. Who, it might not come in time for the holidays. Um, there's actually a couple packages going out. Might not be in time for Christmas, but hopefully the new year. If not, I mean it's the thought that counts. Love you guys for tuning in and, and uh, look for a lot more in 2016 for sure. Um, alright, let's get this fan pack project video going. Uh, this one's kind of, uh, like I said, 
everything that I've ever done with this Fanpack project has been in order of what they came. So um, this one's going to be kind of uh, slow on, on material, but I do have a lot of other stuff for upcoming episodes that uh, will make up for it. So that's why I wanted to sit here and chat for a second. I'm going to take a sip of water. I, uh, I did get two new posters for my collection. I did get UFC 194, McGregor Elbow, and 195, uh, Lawyer Condit. They will be hitting the wall soon. I'm actually running, I'm trying to figure out how to arrange things here. So they didn't go up on the wall yet. Uh, but they will. So this is episode 21 of Fan Pack Project 2015. Um, that means it's Fan Packs 201 through 210. Uh, like I said, not much going on here. Um, but let's get it going. First came up was uh, from Michigan Athletics. And they sent... Uh, Three pocket schedules for the winter sports. So thank you, Michigan. My uh, my rally, my puppies here, hanging out for this episode. Uh, next comes up is Belmont Bruins. Guys, remember check out the uh, about section for my PCs. You guys have been awesome. Uh, they sent three pocket schedules. And the key fob schedule. Also, let me know what you guys think of this angle. I know the lighting isn't so great. I think I'm going to get a sort of a desk lamp or something. Um, and I should probably clean my room. But uh, let me know if you like this angle. I, I feel like the video is not as good uh, compared to the other angle. It's more kind of like HD-ish, kind of. Um, but for me, it's more comfortable. Um, to just be able to sit at my desk. Like, my desk is here, so. Um. Next comes up, North Kentucky. They are the Norse. A lot of colleges again, guys, and I really know of a lot of colleges, so. You guys know. Pocket schedules for basketball. All three, three pocket schedules. Watching UFC Reloaded. Or Evans Rashad Evans or something. If you guys haven't noticed, I like a little, I like a little UFC. Oh, my throat hurts already. I haven't been talking for like a week or so, so it's, it's kind of... Uh, this comes from Humboldt. Humboldt Blackos. They sent a letter. Basically, it's my request letter. They sent. They are uh, a hockey team, SJHL Hockey League. They sent the league schedule. They sent their team schedules. And they sent the magnet schedule. So, I want to ask, cause, oh, Saskatchewan Junior Hockey League. So, thank you, Broncos. I think I, I didn't even know I emailed them. Uh, next comes up is from Manhattan University, or Manhattan College. They're the Jespers. They are pocket schedules. And they sent a couple of the magnet schedules. Guys, also, I know my videos have been in the 15 minute range. Uh, let me know if that's too long for you guys. I know you guys are really enjoying my videos, and I, I love it. Um, and I do ramble a lot. And I take my time, I try to interact a little bit. Um, but if the videos are too long for you guys to watch, let me know. I'll, I'll try to speed it up. I know D-Nuggets will be like, no, make them longer. 
Uh, next comes up, let me see what number I want, 206, this is the second time I've gotten the University of Memphis Tigers, and per usual, they hooked it up, Pocket Schedule City, also if you guys, anybody is interested in Pocket Schedules, or I think maybe I might be giving away some stuff, so if Anybody, 20 episodes, guys, we're 20 episodes deep. If you guys seen anything that you might want, don't be afraid to drop a hint in the comments because, um, you know, I like to see what I get and I keep what I really like and I, I guess that I store stuff. Uh, you know, obviously there's stuff PC that I can't give away, but, and I know shipping and all that's expensive for me, but, uh, want to give back. So I was a little tired. It's two o'clock in the morning here. Uh, I want to give back to the community as much as I possibly can. Um, so if there's anything you guys do like, let me know in the comments or I, my email. I believe is in the about section. Um, I do have T-shirts and stuff that don't fit. That I, I kind of got some ideas of. Um, I want to give them away. So. Uh, let me know if there's anything you guys like or really want, and I'll see what I can do, um, and hopefully vice versa. So, uh, next comes up, 207 is the Oakland University Athletics. Oakland, this this what got me. Oakland University Athletics. They're in Rochester, Michigan. Now, I live near, well, I'm all the way from Rochester, New York, but I just think it's funny that it's Oakland. And it's in Rochester, Michigan. But uh, they have the Bears. They sent these really nice schedules for that for the basketball pocket schedules. There's three of them. Um, so they're very nice. This is basically the pocket schedule episode. A lot of small envelopes. Uh, Two hundred and eight is MSU, or sorry, MSUM. It is. I don't. I don't remember. Oh, fans. Oh. Uh, Minnesota State University in Moorhead. This is the second time they sent me one. Not sure if it's the same as the first. I believe it is. Um, letter. Return. S-A-S-E. Which. Just a couple pamphlets, guys. Brochures. For the Booster Club. Um, you know, the schedule card, the long one, um, more schedule, and another, uh, kind of like, pamphlet, division one, or their division two, sorry, pamphlet, so thank you again, second time they got that to me, and, uh, we got two more. This one's from Missouri State Bears. Okay, so these are all open prior. Um, but our next, our challenge, our season, I will not be opening any of these prior. So it'll be a surprise. That's going to be killer. Killer. I don't know, d if you're going to do that or not, that's personally what Encore is going to do. Just so our viewers uh, on both of our channels think it's fair, um, I know it'll kill us not to open our fan pack, especially if we get boxes, again guys, ton of pocket schedule, cards, kind of hard to see because of the color, and me, it makes it dark, uh, they sent 10 of those, and they sent uh, a couple of these posters, but the schedule again is dark. I need another light. That's kind of like why I like the other a little better because there's more light. So I think I'm going to switch it for next episode. But just to chill, man. Keep it comfy. I can just lean back in my chair. You guys get a good uh, do my Sabres flag and my UFC poster collection. We do also have Conor McGregor in the corner, the new champion. Um, 
I did run Jose Aldo to win in UFC 194. Um, I'm also going to start doing some UFC recaps and stuff like that. Um, I did want Jose, Jose Aldo to win. Uh, I knew Connor would put up a good fight. He's a really talented guy. Um, he won one punch, knockout, 13 seconds in the first round. So, but that poster, uh, I'm not a huge Conor McGregor fan. I do respect him as a fighter, uh, not so much as a person, and I do respect him as a promoter because, I mean, he is good for the sport. I just think he's a little cocky, uh, even though he, he does back it up. So, I mean, I can't really say too much bad stuff about Conor. Um, his fights, he's just happened to caught fighters that I, I, I PC that I like. Um, excuse me. So that poster actually came from Ireland. It's only made in Ireland. Um, it was a special promo. Uh, my buddy was in Ireland, and he got it for me. So I hit the wall instead of one of my brothers. But my brother has been getting a lot of stuff from me lately. Uh, last up, this is Fan Pack 207 Wrap It Up, episode 21. I always do this, but you guys know what I'm doing. The drinking episode. I should probably sip something. I'll sip some water since I don't have anything well I have alcohol to drink but uh, wrapping up this episode guys I scared the puppy this is uh, another number two, another repeat nice to get it there Indiana University the Hoosiers and they send a nice one here to you know to wrap up the episode so uh, they sent the uh, rubber wristbands. I don't really have much more room. I'm actually going to go through my wristband collection because um, I want to add a couple. But my Red Sox Nation and my Sturgis Rally. So they sent two of those. They sent two of these uh, keychains, packet schedules. Guys, go check out. All the people who comment on my site, check them all out. A lot of these guys got fan pack videos up now, which is cool. We're getting in the game. A bunch of stickers here. Uh, so we're getting some new fan packers to the community. So awesome. Uh, everybody keep posting videos. I'm going to watch them. I'm going to like them. I, I watch YouTube all day. I watch fan pack videos all day. UFC stuff all day. Uh, cool little cancer ribbon magnet. Really like that. That was cool. I didn't get that in my last one. Bottle opener. Oh, it was I mean, Rashad Evans versus John Bones Jones. Uh, poster. Quick one I can show you because it's not that big. Uh, I'll show you these ones too. Why not? You guys know my poster clip. Uh, this is kind of cool. Sports Illustrated Carters and such. You guys know my poster collection is massive, man. I get put, I don't even know what to do with them all. They're hard to send most, so really try not to, if you're going to ask me for anything, try not to ask me for posters. Um, I might throw some random mystery fan mail. If you guys email me your uh, mailing address, um, if you guys don't want it left on here, email it to me, and I'll see what I can do. Alright guys, we're going to kick this uh, episode out the door, and uh, as always, like, comment, subscribe, I'm on court 30 and I'm out.